Lao Tzu uh, apparently said that the, the gentlest thing in the world can overcome the hardest thing in the world. So when we apply this to our own lives and we think about how hard we can be on ourselves and indeed on others, uh, how judgmental we can be, arrogant, uh, dismissive, patronizing, uh, bullyish, um, aggressive, ar all these things that, that, that are, are an aspect of that part of us that can be very, very hard on self, therefore on others. And there are in each one of us, in every one of us, there is a space, a place inside us that is like a rock. It's hard. And in that rock is locked up the emotional memories, trauma, pain, that we don't want to, we don't want to feel. We don't want to go there. We don't want to deal with it. We prefer to keep it hidden. Keep it hidden away and pretend it doesn't exist. Pretend we're over it or I don't do that stuff or that fluffy stuff, fuzzy wuzzy stuff, whatever. It's easier to dismiss it, ignore it, project it onto other people than actually take responsibility for it, deal with it, embrace it, accept it, heal it, love it. We can be incredibly hard on ourselves. And the only person who can stop that, the only person who can change that is you, for you. No one else. And the only way you're going to really do that is to go to the, is to do the complete opposite. You need to do the very thing you have been avoiding doing in a very real and tangible and heartfelt way. And that is to be incredibly gentle. Like as if someone placed in your hands a newborn puppy, a newborn kitten, or a newborn child into your hands. You melt. Now you may also panic a bit because you don't want to drop it, but that's, never mind that. You melt. Your heart immediately opens. If even, if even just for a second. That's gentleness in action. That's you being purely, completely gentle. And in that is where your power is. Your power is in your gentleness. Your power is being completely compassionate towards you. And then you can go to that rock and you can see for what it is and you can give yourself permission to open it and it will open and it will give you what it's holding simply because now you're, you're meeting it with absolute compassion and gentleness and that's how you overcome anything that is how you overcome everything is the power of the heart that gentleness that complete non-judgmental, uncompromising acceptance. Gentleness. Be gentle with yourself. Talk to you next week.